Hi everybody, after the last video in which I demonstrated um, a few of the new features in the Boundary Editor of Integrator 2012, I've saved the outcome. As you can see, there are three new files and the boundaries for the first screen actually look like this. Now, to demonstrate the new features that I just finished, I'll do what I did in the last video, create an isolated area where Armad Cooney cannot step. But I will do it, uh, hopefully, in um, less time than last time. Let's see how it goes. So we get started by creating a single segment. Bring it in selection over here so I can then move it around until it has got the right length okay that's fine move it in the middle of the screen so I can see it and split 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 this element now this is where the first feature comes handy if I want to move this point around I can do so and without move moving around randomly, we will see it, not randomly, but following the mouse pointer uh, without any constraint. Now if I want to just change the slope of this segment, what I do is hold down the shift key and then, you know, no matter if I move the mouse horizontally, either willingly or not willingly, I will only be able to change the slope of this segment. If I don't keep shift down, as you can see, I can move things around as, as I want. And the last bit of uh, this exercise is doing this one. So that's done already. Now the other thing I've finished tonight is an additional option to control the length of this segment by means of the mouse wheel. If I move it up, you know, it's longer or shorter. If I hold down the control key it's twice as fast to do that. And what I can do is if I count actually the steps I do with the wheel, I can resize this area uniformly. That's it. One, two one two one two one two nice one two one two one two one two I just have to count if I want to resize the whole thing yeah and of course what I can do is to make it like this Okay, I will not save this one, and let's now see how it all fits together. Because it's nice to, you know, do it. So what I've done here is um, I've preloaded the results from Integrator 2012. Uh, as you can see, the game is, is fully functional. it to you. Well, I've got the cheat mode for myself, so I don't get the scratch. They hit me. Nothing at all. Anyway, what I want to demonstrate is that this is actually an obstacle. Armacuni cannot go past it. And at the same time, you know, the overlapping, the clipping, the sprite clipping is in place. Why is it in place? Well, have a look at this. I've got the sprite clipping enabled here for the first location, the one I modified. That's about it. Thanks for watching. Bye.